All right, well, I worked some more with this um, LC or tank circuit as a receiver of um, energy. And this is basically the Tesla radiant energy receiver where he used a metal plate and he picked up, um, at least in his theories, uh, the energy coming through the air from the sun and then he did a ground on it with a capacitive circuit in the middle to capture the energy. And um, I just wonder, and I really wonder if this, this was what he had in mind, was this uh, tank circuit, basically. And uh, the formula that Tensil Koala put forth is maybe uh, applicable to this uh, idea. I, I don't know. If you had a big enough plate, maybe it would work. And maybe it's just the frequencies that I've seen used uh, in, in this formula for the receiver part that weren't quite right because I've never seen anybody do this and get much energy out of the sun um, or the air just using a metal plate but this works with the Slayer exciter and uh, this runs in the kilohertz um, this would be the antenna the plate and then there's the little uh, LC or tank circuit and there's a chunk of aluminum just as the ground now an earth ground would be much better but let me show you how this works watch the LED I'm gonna flip this on right here and there goes the light and that is tunable the uh, oscillator is running here this is this Slayer exciter oscillator and you notice it's wireless it's just going across the air gap to this metal plate and this LED is picking it up but watch me tune this right out of resonance And I just wonder if maybe some of the people that have worked on this before simply didn't have the resonance circuit correct to capture the energy that's uh, all around us. We are bathed in it. And if you made a resonant circuit, tank circuit of some kind, perhaps that's what's needed is just uh, work the formula correctly. I don't know, but uh, when I saw this happening, with an adjustable circuit on the tail end of this thing I just wonder you know if, if maybe we ought to take another look I'm sure people have um, the Tesla radiant energy receiver and uh, work that formula better on it but anyway that's just my thoughts on this uh, little device that I came up with uh, which was inspired by Tensil Koala's work with this thing and uh, very very fascinating little device. I mean it really is. The, and this is not an inductive link up. This is a capacitive link up. This is a capacitive link up here. This is not induction at all. So anyway just my thoughts on that and uh, anybody else uh, want to take a stab at this that has a Slayer exciter it's not that hard to do. Thanks for watching.